Imbuing ingredients are used by characters with the imbuing skill to add powerful magical properties to weapons, armor, shields, and jewelry. Each attempt to imbue consumes specific quantities, with higher strength properties requiring additional high-intensity components, along with increasing amounts of magical ingredients and common gems. Many of the components can be found as loot on creatures at mini-champs in the Stygian Abyss and a few other locations. Here, I will cover the ones required to imbue rings and bracelets. Ingredients can also be purchased on vendor search if they are available, or via the Fulfillment Order Board in Haven. The Fulfillment Board is exclusively available on UO Alive. Essence of Diligence is needed to imbue the Faster Cast Recovery property onto jewelry. It can be found as loot on creatures at the Stygian Dragon Lair Entrance Minichamp. It can also be found in Treasure Map Chests. Essence of Achievement is used to imbue the Faster Casting property onto items. It is looted from creatures at the Abyssal Lair Entrance Minichamp. It can also occasionally be found in Treasure Map Chests. Essence of Order is required to imbue the Lower Mana Cost property. It can be found on creatures at the Fire Temple Ruins Minichamp. Fairy Dust is needed to imbue the highest intensities of lower reagent cost. It is looted from pixies, fairy dragons, and wisps in the abyss. Lower reagent cost can be imbued from 1% to 18% without fairy dust. Imbuing 19% LRC requires 5 fairy dust, and imbuing the maximum 20% requires 10 fairy dust. Essence of Singularity is the ingredient needed to imbue the defense chance increase property onto weapons, shields, and jewelry. It can be looted from creatures at the Passage of Tears minichamp. The ingredient Essence of Precision is on creatures at the Crimson Veins minichamp. It is used to imbue the Hit Chance Increase modifier. Crystal Shards are required to imbue high intensities of damage increase and spell damage increase. It is looted from creatures in the Cavern of the Discarded, and as a rare drop while lumberjacking into more. Crushed glass is needed to imbue the Enhanced Potions property onto jewelry, and discovered on creatures in the Cavern of the Discarded, or alternatively crafted by a blacksmith. Chaga Mushroom is required to imbue high intensities of luck onto items. It spawns on the cavern floor in the back of the Tomb of Kings, as well as on the ground near the entrance of the Abyssal Infernal Champion spawn. Bura Pelt is required to imbue high intensities of physical resist, fire, cold, poison, and energy resist onto items. A pelt will always drop as loot from the High Plains Bura, and occasionally from the Lowland Bura and the Ruddy Bura in Termor. Crystalline Blackrock is needed to imbue high intensities of skill bonus onto jewelry. It can be looted from Ratmen in the Cavern of the Discarded, from Elementals in Ratman Cave, and as a rare drop while mining anywhere in Termor after the book mining for quality gems has been purchased from the blacksmith in Termor. Thank <laughs> you.